All right, today we're back with some BTD6 expert challenges. I've gotten a lot of fan-made challenges, and I don't know what I'm doing with all of them, so stay tuned for that. But yeah, we got this. This is a 2% challenge here. We got all regrow, fast balloons, and let's see if we can defend. So I guess, what's the catch? We just have these panks here. Panks and camo greens. Oh, wait, what's our camo detection? And yeah, it's definitely gonna be the catch here. So what defends camos here? We got the phoenix. So it's straight, it might just be the phoenix here. We get in in time. Ooh, let's... Okay, wait, 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 wait. Ah, okay, I'm spamming the hotkey. Spamming the hotkey. Oh, it does clutch up. All right, we solved it. <laughs> I don't know if I should keep that in. That was too easy right there, but... I don't know, we'll keep it in. We'll get a win. Now we got this one with a 1% win rate this time. One win. Only one win here. Can we get the second win on this? Oh, I'm excited. Leaking strengths is fine. We got 82,000 lives. What the... What? We do have monkey knowledge. Um... High strength health. Okay, we definitely want the... Oh, we don't want the blue gunner. What does Ultra Juggernaut do? Because these aren't regrow, so it might be able to defend the Serenx. So let's go for this. This that you on last. And then... We do have 200% Moabs here. I don't know. I just don't know how much we can leak down. How's this gonna do? Do something. <laughs> oh my gosh, this round is crazy. Okay, so we do get money, so we can go for the Sun Avatar in a second. I don't know what to do here. I have zero idea how much pops. Ooh, this crossbow master is doing all right. I guess, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm completely lost with what to do here. But we're just going to try this. Just see what happens here. Um, Because leaking ceramics is okay. It is okay here. But it looks like the crossbow master is targeting the wrong thing. We're leaking ceramics. Okay. Um, We don't get money from the ceramics we leak. So that's a problem. So we're not really getting that much money here. So let's restart. You know what I think we need? I think we need two crossbow masters. Because I think there's monkey. Yeah, there's two monkey. Look at that. All right, so now we'll get quick shots up on both of those. We'll do that, and then we could also go for jungle drums. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Go for you, and then we'll just try that. Is that is that foolish, or should we be going for the stronger stimulant? Definitely cross double crossbow master. The reason we have monkey knowledge, I'm just I'm smelling the crossbow master here. The leaking strikes. Let's set these on strong then. Let's set these on strong, strong, strong. Come on, buddies. Look at the pierce. It has to be the crossbow masters. Tanking a ton here though. We don't want the damage to be wasted because something like damaging a mob and then just having it leak through, that's wasted damage. Hmm. 10 minutes later. Uh, okay. And we have enough for the Berserker Brew now. What well, if we set one of these on last again? There's so many ceramics. Look at that. Oh my gosh. There's zero way. Although, that's kind of close. The thing is, we ha can't defend the DDTs yet, though. What defends DDTs? Is there anything here that can actually defend DDTs? Arc Mage is actually a solid pick. Okay, I have zero idea what I'm doing right now, but we're just gonna try the Arc Mage and just see how it does. Hey, look at this thing. Look what Monkey Sense do. Look at that. Ceramics leaking down, that's fine. That's pretty good. So, there's that. That's about... That's pretty comparable to what we had last time. But can we defend DDTs is the question. See, DDTs still, we can't defend them. Even though we're actually defending the Moabs. We're actually going to survive. We need the DDT power. So, we have $15,000. What defends DDTs? I'm going to try the tag just because the tag locations are so good on this map. DDT defend... No, like, like, how do we defend DDTs? <gasps> we have shattering shells. Oh, oh, I got it. I got it. I got it. Shattering shells. How big is the hitbox? We'll just try it right there. And then what else can we afford? I think we'd want, if we had to get anything, I would say alchemist. Let's see what happens here. Shattering. Oh, actually, that'll help against these. <gasps> Look how good shattering shells is. Oh my gosh, I'm so, like, bad almost. I just forgot about Shattering Shells. I just, like, don't ever use the Mortar because it's just the Mortar. I don't know what to say. But that is insane. Oh my gosh. No, no Fortified. We can retarget this thing along just to help out, but, like, look how much pops. What? It does more pops than the other, the, the Wizard. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I cannot stop saying oh my gosh. Uh, come on. 
All right, 17,000 lives. That's way more lives. And then we have the, the this. Let's try this. I'm just going to leave it there, though. I want to defend the DDTs. Let's slow it down. Hit it. Is it hitting them all? It is. Maybe. Okay. Come on. Seek. Oh, it's nearly pop. Wait! Oh, we we're so close right there. We need a better wizard spot for sure. I think that's it, though. And then the mortar will start it at the top. We'll micro it way better. And then we'll sell... We have a free dart monkey, too! Oh, we gotta go for the free dart, dart monkey. Now we got this. We're shattering them a lot sooner here. What is shattering shells? Oh my gosh. We're just gonna keep this right here. Get all the, the ZMGs burning. All the BFBs burning. There we go. Oh my gosh. Gosh, mortar just like went way up on my like internal like I'm gonna use in the mortar way more now. Oh my god <laughs> I cannot believe how good it is. And it's hitting all of them. There's not I don't know if there's a pierce cap or not. What the heck? Actually little, 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 let's not pop the BFBs quite yet because then it's more manageable. See the strat? Now we're managing a lot better. There we go. Okay, similar life count to last time, actually. Oh, wait, we can prioritize camo! <gasps> oh my gosh, prioritize camo? Oh no, but these things are getting decamoed. Well, that's not fun. Oh well. <laughs> Let's keep this up first, come on. Oh, I need, I need to move this around better. Oh, that's on me for not moving around the mortar. Oh, look how close we were, too. I just forgot to move around the mortar. We'll keep it on slow, because we've been keeping it on fast problem okay eh. um we need to target the Z the the ddts at the end because that's where the weakness is the archimage oh shoot i missed a little bit come on oh 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 we set this done strong Oh, is that the solution this whole time? Okay. Boom. Oh, one life. Okay, yes, yeah, so you can leak all story. Oh, I see, I see, I see. We got it, we got it, we got it. GG right there. What a crazy challenge. That was an awesome challenge. That's so smart. Math it out. That probably took so long to, like, build up right there. And look at that. We got the second win on it. Like, it's not... Okay, whatever. And lastly, we got Don't Pop Too Much. All right. And they got 2% win record. That's pretty crazy right there. Let's see if we can do it. All right, we got round 79, which we know is Regrow Rainbows, but no high Regrow Rage is great. We got high mob health, though. So BFB is going to be hard. Ceramics... Yeah, defending the BFBs, that's going to be the problem. The balloons are not a problem. So we defend BFBs and a ZMG. So how can we do that? We get one monkey, but we can sell. So that's interesting. Don't pop too much. Don't pop too much. Oh, we have the balloon trap. Oh, we can't afford XXL trap. Okay. So maybe we need to pop the region rainbows, and then we'll worry about the BFBs later. The fact that we only get one monkey is messing with my head. What if we get a century champion? It's so weird still. I know, I know. I, I do think that Ninja Kiwi didn't have to do this. I do think, I do support this, but it's definitely like, it's so weird. Okay, what about this? So it doesn't hit the BFBs. Ceramic level is 2000%. So I wonder if we can defend the ceramics. Like, l realistically, we might not want to defend the ceramics. Let's go for this. How's that doing? No. The thing is, I don't see an insta kill. The thing is, I don't see an insta kill besides XXL trap. How close are we? We're way too far. Unless you get money. You want? Yeah, no, okay. We do have Bomb Blitz, even though we can't leak down. Bomb Blitz is a solid option. Let's do this. Yeah, that defends that. So that's not a problem. What is a problem is these BFBs. I think I'm smelling the Bomb Blitz. It's gotta be a Bomb Blitz. Um, is it even doing damage to these BFBs? Okay, so there's gonna be a point where the region rails stall out. So what do we what do we go from there? So we're we're defending the rainbows, no problem. I have zero idea. Let's just go with the flow. Okay, are we popping these balloons? I think there's no more balloons. What do we do? Don't pop too much. That's the title. 
<gasps> we can afford Blue Master Alchemist. That's way cheaper than I thought it'd be. Okay. Um, we don't have a lot of leeway though. We can't really buy something and then buy. What is this? Ooh. So let's say we get at the snowstorm, and then we sell it. We go for the Bloon Master Alchemist. We can. We do have enough money. So let's go for a snowstorm in the back, so we can see more. So what we're doing? Oops. Okay. How's this? That's not gonna work. Okay. Okay. So if we do Relentless Glue. It does stall, but it's not enough. We need... We're not even a stall. We just need a way to pop them quickly, maybe. Okay, so it's just a matter of finding a defend that's cheap enough to afford the Blue Master Alchemist. Five minutes later. Oh, we're so close. Wait, you get money, though. We could do Plasma Accelerator. We have, like, just enough money. We just don't want to go for any of the cross paths. Or maybe you get up enough money. I want to try... Let's try Powerful Darts. Yeah, wait, 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 wait. Okay, okay, okay. Do something. I want to find a consistent spot, because aiming it is not, like, feasible when there's that fast balloons. Um. Could also try the bottom path. The bottom, yeah, different path dartling, but. Look at that. That's, see, that's defending nearly. It has to defend the first balloons, but, like. Oh, we have faster barrel spin in the middle. That might be better. We need to defend the first region rainbow. <gasps> yes! Okay. Do we get up enough money? And it, look how much money we're getting. Do we get up enough money? So we gotta just do this. Watch the pop count. It's so a pop down story. Once it slows down, we'll stop. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. That's, that's slow down. So the balloons are gone. So let's don't pop too much. So now we need to go for you. We have enough money. Hey, get those reds. Get the reds! Oh my gosh. Okay. Uh, <laughs> don't pop too much means that Alchemist has to hit one one balloon at a time, maybe. Just so it can hit the reds. Let's... We don't want to pop too much. So let's put the Alchemist, like... Here, so it can clutch up against red... Oh, can it shoot from anywhere in the map? Defend the red, defend the red. Oh, acid pools, please. Oh, acid pools! Oh, acid pools are OP! That's the solution right there. I didn't realize acid pools could actually defend reds like that. That's fantastic. All right, and we got a ZOMG this next round. Easy peasy. GG. And that's going to do it for today's video. Please drop a like if you enjoyed and brush your teeth.